Howdy, and welcome to my desktop. Uh, yeah, for this tech video, we're going to do something slightly different. I'm going to go through how to do an a um, an online crash dump analysis for you know on your machine blue screen, so you can see what went wrong. Uh, so first thing you got to do is make sure you have some mini dump files. Uh, N is my old Windows 8.1 installation. This is obviously Windows 10, so we'll go to my old 8.1. Uh, you'll see I have a folder here, mini dump, there. My machine crashed a few times, so there's my mini dumps. Um, my l the last time was the 5th of August, which was the day I installed Windows 10, actually. Uh, it died that afternoon, which really helped nudge me along to the, hey, let's, uh, let's install Windows 10 on this machine and see what happens. Uh, I do ap apologize for the, uh, the the peh noises. I don't have a filter in front of this microphone yet. I only bought it today. Uh, so yeah, it's a, it's a bit sad. Uh, so first place you go is this wonderful online page. Uh, I'll put a link in the description to it, but it will... Uh, you choose the mini dump file, so we'll go n colon slash windows slash mini dump, like so, and we'll just feed it the one from the 5th of August. Now open that there. You do not have permission to open this. Okay. Let us uh, fix some permission properties first. Security. Advanced. Continue. Add. Yeah, wh whatever. Uh, add. Uh, let's add me. And give me full control of the file. Okay, now should we add a reader? Ah, look at that. Okay. So, we send that file up to them. And it will just do an analyze. This can take a moment. Alright. So, it crashed my machine with an unknown bug check code. So, what we can do is we can look up that code. Bug check 0x00000130. And we find that that is... Ah, invalid IO boost state. Never heard of it. So it's good just to uh, Google the problems. So, uh, Windows detected a driver has a memory leak. Ah, it's, it's a new era in Windows 8. Probably has a lot to do with my poor broken motherboard. Uh, don't use your main machine to test uh, potentially dodgy RAM, because the dodgy RAM may damage your board, which in the case of this machine is what happened. It now only has 12 gig because I can't put four sticks of RAM in the machine. It had four until it broke. Uh, now this won't tell me what driver died. I have noticed there's not great for Win8. It's good, but it seems to miss a few things. But it does give you an idea. Usually the stack's a little bit more useful. Uh, I've never heard of that. Let, let's just Google that because as you can see here, it was a function that crashed, so let's just have a look in here. Google tells me that not much. Uh, hmm, okay. It had a hissy fit, it blue screened. We'll try a different crash dump file. Uh, let me just fix up the permissions on this one. Uh, security, advanced, Continue, add uh, me, and give me full control. Well, half these dialogues in Windows 10 are completely different, and I don't quite know what they are. So this one's the 29th of the 7th. So let's just grab that one. Uh, we'll occasionally do a full memory dump. You don't want to try uploading that to this. Uh, I don't know if I have one in here. Let's just have a look. Uh, yeah, as you see, you don't want to update that because it, it it does have a lot more information in it, but 
that it also makes it bigger. It's a huge chunk of memory. Uh, that was the same crash, so let's just try this one. Security, advanced, continue, add, select principal, at me, full control. Apply, okay, okay. Okay, so that was the same crash. Uh, this one was the 25th of the 10th, 2014, and that was before I broke this motherboard, so... Let's just see what this crash is. Just let it do its analyze. I don't have any good examples. Ah, here you go, critical structure corruption, bug trigger, blah 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 blah. Okay, so... Oh wow, that's a huge stack. KE bug check X. KE bug check is actually the function in the kernel that triggers a blue screen. I don't think a driver can call it though. I'm not actually sure. There's all my drivers. A stack that's got absolutely no idea what's in the stack. The full dump will usually have much more useful information in it simply because. No, it's it's taken a huge dump of memory. Interpret that as you will. Uh, however, yeah, these aren't as useful as I'd have liked. However, this service is good. The other way to do it's manually through the debugging tools. Uh, I will do a video on that at some point. Uh, I've got to get them first, but yeah, so it's a quick and easy, and usually is slightly more useful than what this was. I don't know if that's hex or binary or what. Uh, it'd probably be hex. Anyway, um, thanks for watching this, and yeah.